All right, this problem looks a bit more complicated because we have A, B, and C, but really it's not. Notice the first direction is right down. If you're asked to write down something, that means no work needs to be shown. You're really just writing down what the answer is. So the value of C, we know that C is the vertical shift. Our graph has been moved up two. We know that because the asymptote is now at two. So that means our value of C must be two. Finding A and B, I'm gonna start with my easiest point of zero, five. So using zero, five, we get that five is equal to A times B to the zero plus two. B to the zero, of course, is one. Move the two to the other side. We get that A is three. So now we're going to use negative a half eight. So eight equals three times B to the negative half plus two. Move two to the other side is six. Divide by three, I get two. And now to make this a positive one, I need to raise it to the negative two power on both sides to keep equality. Two to the negative two is one fourth. So my B value is one fourth. So now I've got my B, my A, and my C. And I could write the equation, but I have already answered the question.